I love Animal Crossing. I love Animal Crossing. It's my favorite video game, for sure. We're soon gonna have an Animal Crossing game for the Switch. Nintendo win, and I wanna make a piece of media symbolizing my love for Animal Crossing. So I thought about how I could do that. How could I show the world my love for Animal Crossing? And of course I do a lot of cosplay. I cosplay a lot. So I could make Animal Crossing cosplay. That sounds fun. I can do that. Sure, sure, sure. That's not enough. I need to make this a full experience. This is an Animal Crossing experience. The way I visit Sarah, when I go to visit Sarah, is I take a very long train. This train, specifically, is the Sunset Limited from Los Angeles to Tucson. It is a 10 hour train ride. It is not fast. However, it's overnight. I'm going to visit Sarah in exactly seven days from now. As you know, Animal Crossing has trains. The first thing that happens in Animal Crossing is you're either in a car or a train, depending on which game you're playing. You, you sit down in the train and you like answer all these questions about what kind of person you are. And that determines what your character looks like. So I figure why not make this multimedia tribute me making a cosplay on the train. So I did a lot of research. Can I use a sewing machine on the train? The answer is, uh, I can't, I don't see why not. One, there's one case, one noted case of someone doing it. There was a, there's a picture on Twitter. Here it is. A very old woman using her very old sewing machine on the train. I am going to make an Isabel costume on the train in the less than 10 hours that I have to do it. So, step one. Make a pattern. I made a pattern. Here's my pattern. Step two. Buy the materials. Isabel's most famous question mark outfit is her like green, the light green one. I would call it a lime gingham, checkered gingham fabric. Unfortunately, lime green checkered gingham is not a very popular fabric to make clothes out of. So it doesn't exist. This is the closest I could find. It's like really tiny gingham. So the like side things are made out of this dark green so that's gonna be the top and i have like buttons and stuff then the she wears a denim skirt here's the denim i'm gonna make a skirt out of it that's not that hard but i am a little nervous about it <gasps> I'm a little, i don't like i don't like confrontation if they ask me to put my sewing machine I'm, I'm gonna away i'm gonna freak out the worst thing that could happen is they walk up to me and they're like, I'm sorry, ma'am, you can't use a sewing machine here. We're on a train. It's not safe. And then I'll be like, I'm so sorry. I just wanted to make some cosplay. <laughs> of course, then there's going to be the people that like come up to me and they're like, what are you making? Uh, I'm making this dog. I'm going to become a dog. That's cool. I'm from Orlando, Florida. That's really cool. I I I'm from wherever. Who cares? I have a daughter who sews. That's nice. I'm really happy for you. So those, I, those are the two things I'm anticipating happening. I'm really nervous. I'll see you in five days. Wetzel's Pretzel's Mukbang at the LA Union Station. These are really good. I've never had Wetzel's Pretzel's before. It is currently 8.30 p.m. My train doesn't leave until 10 p.m. And I've just taken a one hour train ride from where I live to LA and I am hungry. The architecture of this place is really incredible. I'm traveling with this really annoying cat. It's really stupidly big and everyone keeps staring at me because it looks like some sort of scroll or something. Also, on my last train ride there was a lady who kept talking to herself. I know, I'm that lady. So that's cool. I'll check in with you again once we're set up on the train, which is kind of nerve-wracking. Hello, we're aboard the train. We have not taken off yet. So let's see how this goes. I did. I made a bet with myself. 
first time I've seen somebody sewing on the train. <laughs> This is a really weird experience. Like one time I was sewing during an earthquake and this is what it felt like. It is so hard to sew straight. Pretty heavy, yeah. Oh yeah, it's heavy. I met a guy who got a tuba. Oh, oh, it's just it's this costume. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Costume for what? Uh -huh. Whatever. Let's see if I can make it on a train. <laughs> bad for like two hours of work. Thank you. And with that we're done. Tomorrow morning, the crack of dawn, we're gonna see if this fits. I made this entire costume in an hour and 30 minutes. Not bad. Join me tomorrow morning at like 6.30 or 7. Good night. How do you like it? Your outfit? Yes. It's super cute. <laughs> it didn't dawn on me that you're gonna put it on. So my first thought was like, oh, probably work cosplay for the train. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> If there's no Animal Crossing for the Switch trailer, by the time this video goes out, I will be extremely offended. So, I did it. It was actually really fun. I highly recommend sewing on the train. If you were going on a train ride that's longer than like four hours, highly recommend it. Yeah, everyone was like super nice. They were like so excited. Like every, almost every conductor that passed me, you know, had something positive to say. Uh, all of the passengers were like 
so excited. A couple, one, only one person actually asked me quite a question. And sure enough, she did get very uncomfortably close to me. But um, I wanted to do this because I looked a hot mess. A hot mess. Because I had to do my makeup on the train. After being on the train for 13, 14 hours, my face was off. And now I feel like I can properly evaluate this costume. The biggest thing about sewing on the train when I was making this was that I couldn't try it on without feeling incredibly awkward because I am an awkward person, if you couldn't tell. The shoulders were rough, even when I was sewing it. There was, I was having some major issues with the shoulders. But honestly, the fact that it even fits and it even looks slightly presentable, that is a win in my book. This was great. If I took more day trains, I would do this like all the time. Is this up to the standard of my normal costumes? No. But that wasn't the point. My the point was, I love Animal Crossing. Nintendo, please release the Switch Animal Crossing trailer. And now all those people on the train know I, lo I love Animal Crossing enough that I would sew on the train. Please, Nintendo. If you were thinking about sewing on the train, I highly recommend it. I didn't mention. They didn't even check my ticket. They didn't even check my ticket. I never gave them my ticket the whole time I was so the whole time I was on that train, they never took my ticket. Now, is that because I was sewing as a blonde white girl? Yes. But I just think it's funny that they didn't like want to disturb me or something. I don't know. Here is the number one thing about train travel, the most important thing. The people who work on trains, the conductors, they do not care about anything as long as you're not causing issues. Like they all, pretty much the only thing they care about is that you have your shoes on and you're not drunk and you're not being loud and disruptive while people are trying to sleep. That's, that's like it. It's so easy. So honestly, you can pretty much do anything you want in a train as long as you're not being like annoying. And the lounge car is always loud. You can just go in there and be as loud, I mean, not as, not as loud as you want, but like the sewing machine was the quietest thing in that room. People were playing mariachi music. It was a party. The conductors were sitting down and gossiping with the passengers. It was incredible. Trains are so much better than planes. My bag was twice the oversized bag limit. But as long as I could get it on the train and put it where it's not an issue, not a problem. I love trains, you guys. Trains are pretty fun. I wish I could do more train travel. One day in my life, I'm gonna do train jam. And when I do train jam, I'm gonna make another tribute to Animal Crossing. I love Animal Crossing. Please give us Animal Crossing for the Switch. I need it, I need it. Give it to me, give it to me. Ugh. Oh boy, oh. Please like, subscribe, comment, whatever, YouTube stuff. Do it. Please. Please. Thank you. Nintendo, please release the trailer. Thank you. Bye. If you are fluent in another language besides English, you can help us out by translating this video's subtitles.